I've been a painter for the last 30 years or so and in that time I have worked with both um, oil paints or solvent based oil painting processes as well as the water based or acrylic uh, painting process. Um, unfortunately in 2005 I had developed a very strong allergic reaction to any solvent based products whether it be refined linseed oils which are cleaned with solvents or commercially produced oil paints or any other mediums that were associated with the commercially produced oil painting process. Uh, the only solution for me was to continue to paint in acrylics. Uh, unfortunately within four years or five years I had also developed a similar a reaction or a physical um, allergy to the acrylic painting process and all the mediums and paints associated with the commercially produced paints. I was forced to um, start doing some research whether there were um, firstly paints available without any traces of solvents with naturally produced oils and pigments and also um, a painting process which allowed this to uh, take place and produce sustainable and archival oil paintings. Or an artist painter by the name of Luis Velasquez from California who had for the last 15 years researched the materials and painting techniques of the old masters where um, in many cases in the process there is no solvent based products used at all and all the materials used are of an um, organic studio produced nature. Mr. Velasquez um, experimented and devised very simple um, recipes um, which has made it uh, possible for painters like myself to continue painting and to discover that these um, organic ancient and very simple techniques produce a, um, an array of technical possibilities within the range of painting but also um, enable us to um, produce um, paint quality of uh, a, um, a nature which I certainly haven't experienced in the solvent based painting process. So here are my basic uh, painting materials. Paints um, which is pigment and uh, cold pressed walnut oil which I buy from Canada. Um, in this jar we have um, a, quite an old now egg white and oil emulsion for glazes and oiling out and uh, final varnishes. There's um, um, cold pressed um, and um, organically cleaned um, linseed oil which when done in this particular manner is an extremely fast drying oil which dries within 40 hours sometimes overnight um, and of course um, some pigments um, where I can make my own paints if I wish without relying on the um, tube type paints and this is um, my painting medium which is basically um, calcium carbonate or whiting white chalk mixed in with oil which uh, produces a, a nice um, paste um, type painting medium when mixed with paint produces a beautiful buttery consistency of paint which um, allows me to um, paint with a nice flow flow controlled paint quality so these are basically all the materials that I need to continue my painting process and basically if I don't rely on the shop um, board paints I can basically just buy pigments and with these materials which are all homemade I guess apart from the chalk I can continue my painting process. One more thing that has been um, made really easy in this painting process is the cleanup of my brushes or cleanup of my palette. Um, all the brushes are just uh, wiped in oil and cleaned with soap and water and the palette 
also cleaning up old paint is um, very easy to scrape off and and wipe away just with newspaper and a rag and a little bit of oil and um, basically no solvent at all is ever needed for any process within my studio but it also allows me to work in um, in a way that wasn't possible before um, I can work in my studio for 12 to you know sometimes 16 hours if I wish without any um, ill effects <laughs>